Hello! I'm Chris, and this is another episode of Life Collected. And today, we got something from Martian Toys, another Tech 63 for me. Always need to add more of those to my collection. And some more sodas. Funko sodas, to be specific. So let's go ahead and show you what's in the Martian Toys box. Martian Toys. See, sometimes I just cannot pronounce things to save my life. So, we got, which is wrapped up in this little guy, we got another Tech 63. This is from their art series. It actually came with like a weird slight bit of a, like it's kind of like open, but then it's all sealed afterwards. So that was, I was like, that's weird. You see, you see what I'm saying there? Isn't that strange? Like the bottom was open. So we're gonna, go to, <clears throat> we're gonna go ahead and open this thing up and see what's in it. To be honest, I'm not 100% sure. Because I had more than one tech on pre-order. I'm pretty sure I know which one this is, but we'll find out together. Because they didn't actually have like a, a label or anything. Like this is how they look. And so until you open up that window, let's see if we can fix that little damage there to our box. There we go. All right, so now the damage to the little box is fixed. And so how these windows, they're windowed, you can actually see inside that is what we're about to open up. And then they always have a cool like little inner label as well. And this one just says, Tech 63, the in-game quest. Let's go ahead and get them open. So this one was just like an instant buy for me. I happen to really be a big fan of the artist. This guy's name is Frank. I always called it Mysterio. I, you know, you'd have to look him up. I'll, I'll put the link below so maybe you can pronounce it better than me, but that's always what we call the guy. Isn't that neat? It's a skull. And then you can see one eye actually has like an eye in it and the other one doesn't. I thought was kind of cool and then he has like a kind of a camo-y type look to him and then of course a big old skeleton and then a skeleton on his little belly too because they're always the same so you can see it on the hoodie there and then of course they're wearing some shoes oh you gotta wear your sneakers and then the back has your tech 63 logo and another little like, you know, the back of the skeleton, the ribs and such. And then, of course, the very classic uh, from World War II, where they would put on uh, P-52 Mustangs. I've seen a lot of these growing up in Virginia going to the air shows. You would see all the old vintage Mustangs and all the old vintage airplanes. But I really picked it up because I love this guy's, how he does a face and how he does skeletons. And so this is my Tech 63, it's my newest one. And then here are, it comes with hands as well. Oh, falling out there. There we go. It's going, it comes with hands as well. Which is more in like the Run the Jewels logo of like, you know, guns and fist. Is essentially how it is, handguns and fist. Finger guns, I guess, is probably a better term. So I don't know, I don't know if I'm going to, how I'm going to display him, but he'll be up here. Maybe I'll split room with the, uh, the play dot guy. <laughs> my big old hair is in the way. <laughs> I don't have my hair all locked up today. But yeah, so I'll probably put him up here. You know, or maybe he'll go to the, cause he doesn't glow in the dark. This one, yeah, he don't, he don't glow or nothing. The other one that I got recently, there you go. Series. See, this is the one that I recently got another video. That's the, the ball one, the musical group. And that one is glow in the dark. And see, he actually does, this is a uh, Mexican artist, and he hand paints a lot of art that is done in this style. And I've always wanted to get one of these pieces, and they kind of sell out real fast because they're all hand printed. And so I was like, okay, well, I'll get a production one because this is, was produced. And there were, you know, like a couple thousand of these pieces. So it's like, oh, I can a lot easier get a piece with one of these. And then eventually I'll get, because he makes rainbow, like skeletons like this. And that's the one I really want from him. He does like a rainbow skeleton. 
but he only usually makes one or two and then they're gone fast because people like me to snatch that sucker up. But yeah, so this is my Tech 63 by Frank. I have to look up his last name, but it starts with an M. I have it all linked in the description. I went through and did a bunch of redid a bunch of my video descriptions the other day, so they should be more and more accurate. This is a rookie channel, but we're trying to get there, man. We're we're trying. I'm gonna put him back in his little case for now, and then I'll figure out where to display him. And then what's nice is they do have a little display box as I showed earlier. But yeah, so that's my tech. And if you subscribe to this channel, you'll see a lot more Tech 63s. That's for sure. The other one that I got is from the Vault Queen. And the Vault Queen is a very good source for Funko soda. And they definitely stored them really well. I mean, that's how it was. And then the actual little sodas themselves. And what I got is two bat mites. There we go. Hopefully a common and a chase. We'll see, could just be two commons, could be two chases, you never know. And then one that I just had to get as well, Ash from the Evil Dead. And two of those as well. So. Two bat mites and two ash from Evil Deads. And so let's go ahead and open them up. This one getting. You know, maybe in future videos, I'm gonna have to uh, go ahead and push the camera maybe farther away or something so you guys can see me opening stuff. I don't know. I'm still uh, figuring out where to place this. As you can see, there is like a light on me today, see? Because I have like a window that's like to the side. And it's like how I get like half my lighting. So. Don't you hate it when they get like stuck to it? Well, this is Ash from the Evil Dead. And I believe it's a comet, yeah. Any neat looking? You know, just a classic. I believe the uh, a bloody version The pog on that one looks silly. With Ash. And there were um, 10,000 of these. So it's 8,400 of the commons. And the rest are in chases. Whoops. Alright. So let's see what this one is. This one's also a common. We'll put him back in this little thing. And anytime I get a common, you know, they're gonna be something that's gonna be up for either trade or for me customizing. Because I'm gonna be painting these things up. All right. Let's do them higher up so you guys can see, yeah? Let's see, you tell me what it is. Oh, it's a common, that's what it looks like. But I don't have any bat mites, I didn't have any ashes, and so that's why I bought two. I figured I'll buy two, if I get a chase out of it, awesome. If not, then oh well. Use a little blue one. Isn't that cute? The chase is in black. I'm a huge bat mite fan. Bat mite is a fifth dimensional uh, child from another world. Like, obviously he's from the fifth dimension. And so he, he has a little hand sewn costume, isn't that cute? You can see it's actually little stitches around the logo and that and then it's like always he always has a floppy ear because this is like a Halloween costume to him and then he's just dressing up like his favorite hero and then he goes to our our world you know or Batman's world really and because Batman is not in the same universe as us right so he goes to Batman's universe and bothers him ah, there we go all those muscles for something right let's see what do we get all right another common let's see because this one, I actually wanted to get an extra common of anyways, because I'm gonna paint him up in like a rainbow color. I think I'm gonna end up coming out with a whole little line of Funko's customized little sodas and rainbow. I like rainbow, it's cute. But yeah, see, you can see him, he's a cute little figure. I like his oversized eyes and everything, and then he has that belt, but it's a little like loose on him because of how, you know, he's a little child wearing like a little costume. 
So that's what I got for today. I got Ash from the Evil Dead. I got Batmite. <laughs> I got Batmite. And then I got a new Tech 63. The Frank. Bomber uh, one there. They got you the blue bomber. Anyways, uh, thank you so much, guys. That's been another episode of Life Collected. And my truth for today is that I cannot get my lighting right. <laughs> I'm in a uh, my own bedroom, and so I literally have to deal with actual lights. And so, you know, for Christmas, this is filmed in uh, well, actually a day before Halloween is when I'm filming this. And so, well, we'll see, you know, what happens. I'm gonna get some, uh, get some better lighting going. And you know, this is a rookie channel for now, but we're gonna turn pro, y'all, for sure. Bye, y'all. See you in the next video. Bye.